much I know in civil engineer that that was also a part of the detailed architectural scope. So this is to understand this pyramid. Yeah. Then there's the, this middle arches that uh -huh. is very Bengali and very Hindu, and then this arches that is like uh, yeah. Islamic architecture. Lime mortar, they have placed this big, beautiful. So this is lime mortar lime right mortar. there. Oh, Fully okay. lime mortar. And this sort of brick, those are not in existence anymore. But bricks. Ah, okay. So individually they become smaller, and only then only because uh, as a civil engineer now I know this that uh, unless you have an arch, you cannot support the brick. Yeah, I mean this is relatively advanced uh, engineering. So they would be they would be placing be like like you know, like you said yeah. because of the rain because the rush is uh, usually celebrated during okay. the rainy season. So like the temples of what is the impression about the, seeing the, the uh, temples of Vishnupur and the Terracotta temples. So far I've had an amazing day in Vishnupur. I really really enjoyed my visit to the three temples. Um, I had seen photos before, but. The photos didn't do it justice. Seeing it in person, seeing the intricate design and artistry of the temples was very, very impressive. And I would recommend everyone come and visit because I'm really glad I got to see the temples. American tourists, they're visiting Yekora Hobbit. He's asking that whether you will recommend it for American tourists. Yeah, definitely. I will first tell my consulate colleagues, my colleagues, in Kolkata to come visit, and yes, uh, I would recommend it for American tourists. What is the purpose of your visit to uh, uh, Well, a few different reasons. One, to see the terracotta temples. I had heard a lot about them and wanted to see them in person, and I'm very glad I did. Uh, and then two, to come with the NGO Freed uh, to see some of the great work that they're doing here. Uh, we're visiting their computer training center. Um, and having an opportunity to see the work that they're doing to help educate and empower uh, girl, uh, girls here, girl students here in, in the area. And, um, you know, empowering women and fighting gender discrimination and uh, fighting and combating uh, trafficking in persons is something that the U.S. Consulate uh, does a lot of programming on, and uh, we look for ways to be supportive of similar efforts. So I'm very happy to, to visit the computer training center here today as well.